The aggrieved drivers took their protest to the glass house office of ITV and radio to express their displeasure. Spokespersons of the drivers said it is worrisome that after paying the mandatory legal fees approved by the state government, some persons still imposed other illegal fees on them. They alleged that of such fees is the end of year contributions, which was done last year by drivers organized by some selected persons. They alleged that the end of year contribution was later adjacked by some members of the union, pocketing the proceeds from the contribution without recourse to the contributors, thereby defeating the aim the scheme was set up for. The aggrieved members said this year they decided to pull out and contribute and save themselves, a decision that was not accepted by some persons in the union who assorted them. This is my ticket. I'll be buying right from day one. I'll be buying 1,006 every day. But the Rhythian member and the national union, the, the, the so-called leaders, on each route, they are compelling us to, to extort us extra money apart from the ticket every day. Which last two years, they compel us to pay by 100 and they said they are going to share rice at the end of the year, nothing. Then they went to the market to go and buy tin tomatoes to us. They, they invested the money. So this year, we say we're not going to pay any money. Some of the drivers at the park said it was their personal initiative for end-of-year financial package, but denied beating up or forcing anybody to join. I am not aware of that. Even my members of my union, we don't do things like that. We are only after a year to enforce the revenue to make sure they buy their ticket. They make me the leader and we agree together to collect the money. So now they are not telling us it's illegal collection. Chief Odin Olaye of NURTW said he were not aware of the contribution. He promised to investigate the allegations and wondered why drivers must be forced into such venture. Chief Olaye promised that those found wanting would be made to face the full rot of the law. I am not aware of any illegal collection. I will invite the branch chairman and his executive there. And if I find anyone doing any illegal collection, as the approved money of the state government who will arrest that person and prosecute him. The aggrieved drivers have vowed not to relent until justice is served and those behind the illegal acts prosecuted. A Fosa Wangwe reporting.